Mm -hmm. Hello, my name is Christian Mueller. I am a civil engineering student uh, at the National Technology University, um, Paraná Regional School of Engineering. I am 23 years old and I am uh, currently in the fourth year of my current program uh, in search of a solid and complete, completely training uh, that allows my to provide uh, innovate, uh, sustainable and efficient solution uh, to the need of uh, society. <clears throat> I, I am going to present uh, the analysis of flood causal factor and the possible solution um, the, ca the case of Alma Fuerte Avenue. <clears throat> okay. uh, Paraná is uh, a city with almost um, 270 neighbor, neighborhood and uh, uh, 340,000 uh, inhabitants. Um, it has uh, an area of uh, 137 square kilometers and also the um, annual rain days are around uh, 120 to uh, one uh, to 140 uh, days mm -hmm. uh, okay continuing with uh, continuing with the uh, theme uh, Paraná is a coastal uh, city located in the province of Entre Rio which uh, borders Santa Fe and uh, belong to Argentina. In addition, uh, the Paraná River is one of the most important rivers uh, in the region. Uh, my purpose is um, study, study and develop a way to add the problem of fluvial flooding, uh, improve the current uh, situation on Avenida uh, Alma Fuerte Avenue in, in the city, uh, promote, promote the importance of keeping the street clean, uh, propose uh, a simple solution, propose a simple solution. <clears throat> Okay. Turning, uh, turning our attention to the location of the affected place, um, well, the city of uh, Parna uh, has uh, chal uh, challenges uh, among which uh, the problem of pluvial flood uh, stand out. Uh, the city uh, is um, the city is located in a flood prone area and it is crossed by numerous numerous uh, stream, streams and water pools which expose it to a major risk of flooding due to intense and prolonged weather um, prolonged weather, uh, weather events uh, this situation has become uh, become recurrent and worrying for the community, affecting urban areas and nearby uh, nearby rural areas. Uh, this area is important. Um, a specific area where uh, a pluvial flooding problem has been identified is. Alma Fuerte Avenue area delimited by Juan del Campillo and Division de los Andes Street. Uh, this area is important for commercial and residential activity. 
Okay. Uh, the picture of, uh, pardon. Oh, uh, our next uh, point uh, of focus is the problem statement. In the previous la, uh, okay. In the previously mentioned area of Alma Fuerte of um, Fuerte Avenue, flood are generated due to medium magnitude rains. This area is uh, recurrently affected by pluvial flood. Uh, this rainwater flood uh, result in the accumulation of rainwater uh, in the study area. <clears throat> uh, the picture on the right uh, help us uh, to see the problematic a situation where uh, it shows the level that uh, the water can reach and, and the severity of the problem. Um, due to this, uh, due to this, complications are generated in traffic uh, and also in uh, store the um, difficult difficulty for store mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. let's proceed to uh, let's proceed to identification and analysis of cause causa or factors that give rise to the problem uh, the topography of uh, the city of, uh, of Paraná uh, with low uh, area and, and um, insufficient, uh, insufficient draining uh, network uh, makes it difficult uh, a rapid evacuation of rainwater. Um, okay. Another big, uh, another Another big reason is the um, unplanned uh, urban growth of the city that has led to the construction of buildings, uh, street and public uh, areas uh, with, uh, without considering the absorption, absorption capacity of the soil. <clears throat> um, Change in land use and um, urbanization and expansion of um, improvised surface uh, such as uh, concrete and asphalt uh, replace uh, natural water absorption areas such as uh, green space and forest. Um, this uh, this leads to increasing surface uh, runoff, um, runoff and increasing load on draining system. Uh, uh, moving uh, now to the identification and the description of the consequence. Um, okay, uh, some of the conse con consequences that uh, occur, occur due to flooding are the um, damage uh, to home infrastructure and vehicles. Um, most uh, mosquito born disease like dengue and Zika. Uh, Stagnant uh, uh, water can be uh, uh, breathing ground for mosquito born this uh, this size, like dengue and Zika, posing a public health risk. Uh, in addition, uh, water contamination uh, can affect uh, the quality of uh, the drinking drinking uh, water supply. Um, 
and, uh, and increases the risk of uh, gastrointestinal illnesses. Um, soil erosion, uh, degradation of green area, and loss of natural habits. Um, in addition, uh, debris carried by floods can contaminate contaminate rivers and body of water, uh, eliminate aquatic life and biodiversity. Turning uh, our attention to problem approach. Um, one of the case uh, solution uh, proposed uh, in this project is the creation of a green absorption space. This space, this is space uh, consists in, in landscape uh, area, especially the sink to absorb, absorb and retain rainwater by providing a place where uh, water can be absorbed, absorbed into the ground rather, rather than pulling on the street. The risk, the risk of pluvial flooding can, uh, uh, be, can be significantly reduced. Um, these space are not only functional, but also aesthetically pleasing, improving the quality of life in our community. Uh, rise public awareness about clean space, prevent clogging, clogging of storm drains, educate on proper waste disposal, implement early warning system, improve quality of life. Okay. Um, the weaknesses uh, of this proposal are the flowing. The sink and maintenance cost time and effort in education, limitation, uh, limitations uh, in extreme events, and coordination between authorities and community. Um, now, uh, I, now I am going to mention the strengths Uh, sustainable and environmental focus, uh, reduce of flood risk, citizen awareness and participation. Um, in conclusion, um, with uh, this proposal uh, solution, the community can look to a future where the recurring uh, three uh, threats of pluvial flooding becomes more uh, manageable, ensuring a safer and more resilient environment for uh, both residents and business. Um, this is uh, the reference, um, Google Maps, um, Google Earth, um, Un Entre Rio, and La Nación. Pues